Welcome in Cake PHP tutorial again. Uh, this tutorial I'm going to show you how to change default layout. So you can change your layout uh, for all controllers, or you can change your layout for a single controller, or you can change your layout for a single method. So you can do it easily in Cake PHP. So for do, do that, I am going to my app controller because app controller is actually the parent controller in Cake PHP. In every controller they have extends app controller so if you want to change for every controller you have to do it in app controller so I'm just going to app controller and just uh, uh, using a cat PHP built-in method called before filter I'm just going to typing public function before filter and just uh, going to give the event and going to parameter event in here and in here before cac php version 3.1 and uh, before cac php version 3.2 uh, you have to use this layout like that but in cac php 3.2 and greater than 3.1 that means uh, greater than 3.1 you have to use a chaining method in here so i'm just going to use the this view builder and after finish this method I'm going to use the set layout so it's the chaining method and in this method you have to uh, give your new method name uh, sorry new layout name so if you if your new layout name is home uh, you have to create just write the home and just finish it after semicolon if you see the output you will see a error this error calling missing layout that means you have to create the layout call home.ctp in, in your layout folder so i'm just going to home layout folder i'm just going to create the file call home.ctp after save this if you just here write hello and see the output you'll see the hello in here so now if you want to see the your all content also so i'm just going to copy the default layout page all code from default layout page and just paste it in here now if you if you want to change your css file for your all controller you can change it in here so by this you can use change the default layout by this code so now if you want to change the method change your layout for a single method you have to just copy this line and just paste it in a single method for example if you want to change for index you have to just use it in here that's it so it was today's tutorial 